in 2012 on the Shenzhou 9 mission. So they are taking the uh, walkie-talkie one by one and they have been talking to Beijing at, at this point they are trying to tell Beijing that everything is okay at this everything point. Everything is okay and mm -hmm. you may notice that just before the launch of mm -hmm. Shenzhou 15 uh, manned spaceship yesterday the Shenzhou 14 crew uh, did an, uh, a very important job it is to change the station mm -hmm. from the status of three crew mm -hmm. to six crew uh, to six crew mm -hmm. uh, the main the change mainly located in the what we call the regenerative uh, environmental control and life support system mm -hmm. you I know think they're gonna take a family photo at this point but the first they have to anchor themselves to stabilize themselves yes, yes. In space. Uh, it's easy for mr. Fei Jin Long, but uh, a little bit difficult for mr. Deng Qingling and mr. Zhang Lu because they have never been to outer space before but they have been going through a lot of training, so they should be get they should be used to the environment, I think. Uh, so they are taking a selfie. One, two, three. So they are saying that China is uh, Tiangong Space Station, right? And that can this meet your really expectation a, all the time. Yes, this is really a historical <laughs> moment for me. Yeah. All, all Chinese people. Big thumbs up. Yeah, that is definitely a historic moment. Now let's talk about the uh, mission or the task they have uh, after that. They're going to stay together for about a week time, right? For the yeah. rotation and a lot of preparation. And of course, and the, for the Shenzhou 15 crew, they're going to stay in space for six months. And the main objective of the mission include verifying the space station's ability to support crew rotation and achieving the first in-orbit crew shift with the Shenzhou 14 uh, members, right? Yes. And uh, according, according to the plan, Professor Yang, and the, uh, so the Shenzhou 15 spacecraft will conduct a fast autonomous rendezvous and docking maneuver with the assembly in its front port, and that's from a combo of uh, three spaceships, right? So yes. let's, uh, let's come back to the studio at this point. Professor Yang, so we know that, as I said just now, the Shenzhou 15 crew will carry out the verification of long-term residence on China's space station in three module configurations. So what are some of the things to look at in this verification? Uh, you know that uh, both our uh, Shenzhou 13 crew and our Shenzhou 14 crew stayed in the station.